All righty. How are we doing? Welcome. So, we're back for more Kenshi. And... Oh, here we go again. Hey, Baron. Thanks for stopping in. So, uh, we'll be continuing around with Kenshi. Uh, where we left off last, we were in... Um, I forgot the name of the town. I'm having a big brain fart. But uh, we were in the um, Foglands. Gotta give my friends the views. I appreciate you. I love being viewed. You can view me all... <laughs> Witness me. Come crack your part. I know. I know. It's all good. Damn, glass is bugging me. Alrighty. So where we left off, um, turn that down just a little bit. All right, there we go. Um, we were just about to finish our house in uh, Mongrel. That's the name of the town. Sometimes thought of getting Kenshi, but I don't know. I have the patience for it. Reminds me of. That's just Kung Fu. Honestly, it depends on what you want to do. It's got this point, this game is living on infamy. Um, like, this was my attempt. I wasn't going to do a full playthrough as just as a single character. Um, I've seen people do that. That's really hard. Once you get on your feet, like where I'm at now, technically, if I didn't have Doggo, Ein, or Beep, probably go through the whole game at this point because I can at least survive a few hits. But it's still risky. And... But it just depends on how you go about playing it. If you start in like an easy like playthrough, like where um, some of the basic ones will start you in uh, the Holy Empire's land, like Okran's Pride and whatnot. And it's easy to work in here and you can like even get a base start and everything and then you can just trade from the local towns. But that's for like beginning. But outside of that, yeah, it's just your world is your oyster. All right, so we're gonna finish up the house. Uh, Beep is still training dexterity. That's at 18 now. I think I'll stop him when he's at 20 and then I'll have him continue like melee or something. Also, Doggo and Ein are out front. I realized to keep them fed, we can go into the fog lamp. Oh wait, they uh, he just ate a severed arm right there. Or so for example, ugh. We can, um, oh, all the arms are gone now. So we can actually bring a bunch of fog dudes back. And, uh, basically, we feed off of them. But I gotta find some, so we send Doggo out to look for an army of fogmen to bring back. Oh, manor's been built, so this is finished. We can go in there, and we have a bare bones basic manor. So I did kind of look at my rules again, because I didn't know how I was going to do with bases. For now, I'm only going to stick with like renting a uh, renting, buying a home in the already established towns, and then just getting stuff set up there. I won't worry about resource production and all that until I start. I decide I'm going to get more people, One, and that's when we can take care of ourselves uh, combat wise. So, 
Mm, interior, no, surgical bed. It's a tent. A sitting box, stool pillow. Maybe I don't have a box. Do I got to research? Um, we may have to do a, a research bench. And... Okay, how do we rotate this? I know there's a way to rotate it. Build mode. Uh, rotate. Okay, it's period and comma. So we'll just have something like right up front right here. And of course that's going to take um, three construction material, which we have on us. Yep. And he'll get to building that. Where is the Fogman? Oh, let's go ahead and do this. Forgot to put my overlay on. Uh, I think there's a couple right there. Yeah, those are Fogman. Not enough, though. We need more. Where are all my fog people at? Okay, there's a bunch over there. Got them. Speed up time. We found them. Okay, research bench is complete. Um... St no. Yeah, storage? No, no, stop. Storage boxes. It'll be for building materials and stuff. That's not what I want. Gear storage. Box of Fogman. Oh, it's for storing their the the item storage. Here it is. General storage. Yes, we will research that. Gear storage. The beep cult. We've got to have the beep cult at some point. And then we're going to research. We're going to need to buy books, but uh, sparring mats would be good for training. And. Uh, some general lock or some training stuff for eventually the people will get sparring mats will be good for beep right now so i'll start with this first have him uh do some research while we have doggo go grab these people the fog men come on there's an army I mean, come on. Here we go. There we go. Come with me. Yeah, that'll be good to start. That's enough food for a little bit. All right. You guys are slow. Come on. Come on.
<laughs> they want this doggo badly. I think we can have him. Oh, they get stuck on a ledge there. Come on. Don't you all get distracted? Here come all of us. The ninjas, go for it. Oh, there's a limb, it just bit it right off. The gate guards are really nice. So now we got a bunch of severed limbs. That means doggos can eat. Now this one is still probably feeding from his bag. I, I'm willing to bet. So I may actually come grab that in a little bit. Peep is still training dexterity. That's almost 20. Yeah, both Doggo and Ayn are really well fed. Good little boys. Oh, and those are our meatball and chopsticks. Oh, I got people wandering through my home already. Um, okay, item storage is almost done. That's good. Let's we'll speed up time for that. Okay, that's done. Build. Storage. Now well, that's milk and cheese. Oh, town storage. Here we go. Um, storage barrel, crate. We also got to look at building materials. Some of these we can't build. General storage chest. This takes iron plate. That one takes building materials. This is iron plates, but we can go buy those really quick. I hate how you can't butt these up right up against the wall. Isn't there a way to like lock it? Okay, never mind. You know what? I'm not gonna do that. I'm gonna do. Ah, oh, screw it. We'll do. We'll move them later. Confirm those. Or solo, go over here to general store. It has to be on the other side of the map, doesn't it? Or a town. Yeah, so they're set for a bit. With limbs just on the ground. Alrighty. Hello, I am back. I need your iron plates. Also, we'll buy the rest of these. Um, oh, 
Oh, and we're gonna need books for research, so might as well get a couple of those. Those cost 700. Yeah. So we'll get six or um, six for now. And Beep should be done with, uh, or he got kicked off. No, he's still training. Dexterity's almost done. There we go. Uh, Dexterity 20. Um, well, or he can lay down in bed. See, this is why I want to build my own training dummies. Because, uh... Oh, here we go. That way he doesn't get kicked off of them. Alright, Torcello, go ahead and build this chest. And we shall watch it materialize from the ground up. that one so now we got storage um i can go ahead and make your way over here So got that, so we'll go back to research for now. Because where were we, where were we learning? Um, gear storage. And then after that, it's going to be... Okay, we'll need for sparring mats, two fabric, two leather, and two books. So, uh, Torcello, go back to the general store. Yeah, beep. All right, he said fabric. There's only one fabric here. And then leather. I think I have to go get that. I don't think they have just regular leather here. And it did say tech. Oh, wait, no, no, no. Leather is a resource. It's not hide. But he just doesn't happen to have any, I think. See, there's some right there. <laughs> I can always wait till nighttime. Let's check other homes, local homes. Uh, Torcello. Can you not go in there? Or are those homes just for look? I guess you can't. Okay, there we go. Uh, they have nothing, it seems. Oh, they do have stuff. But probably nothing worthwhile. Oh, these are like small shacks. Oh, 
probably won't find much in here. Oh, here we go. Um, tools, wrench, chew stick. I'll grab the the meat wrap and chew sticks and cooked vegetables. Those are actually not bad. We'll check local armor as well. We see fabric and leather. You got rum in there. There's the fabric I'm looking for. should be back at oh he can't go inside can he he's too big now oh, apparently he could fit but let's see if can do the the trick come on I have to do it at every shop Once they're in, they're good. I guess not. I'll wait till um, Corsola gets back. Oh, no, I've been in that one already. Go in that one. I guess you can't go in that one. That, uh, whatever. All right, let's check in here because this is like a mass storage unit. Actually, do they have ore in here? Cats. And of course, they're, they're empty right now. Yeah. Usually these buildings don't have anything. Mods have actually done a really good job with repopulating buildings and stuff. Uh, let's check the bar. Not that I really would go in there for this stuff. We just need one more leather. And... No. Well, he might actually have it in his store. Give me your goods. He does. One, two. All right, now we can go back here. Doggo, you're doing good with the severed limbs? Yep. Yep. All right, Torso trade with Doggo. Oh, he took, I forgot they took hits, but they should heal naturally. Uh, trade. All right, I want you to... Oh, we might have to... Go in... Storage. Get some lights in here, too.
get majority of the food items out. That way, Doggo can't eat those first before the local stuff. All right, and now with research. Uh, we miss it. Not enough. Does that have to be in storage? Oh, in the research bench. Did I not? Oh, they're still in here. Not the food cube. Sparring mats. There we go. And I think I want to move. Uh, you'll be able to research that by morning. Oh, it's getting dark again. Fine. Move over here. Oh, there are all the flies. How's Beep doing? Melee attacks going up. I don't plan to get him... Could use stealth, I guess. Yeah, let's go ahead and... Uh... Oh, he is stealth. Is he actually getting... No, he's not. Too dark. All right, we're going to send Beep across the map. The flies. There was a mod that got rid of the fly sound and that drove people nuts. I just want to make sure they actually eat. Speed up time, I just realized. Yep, uh, eight. What'd he eat? He ate what was left in his bag. I don't know where he's going. Oh, he's playing limbs. Okay, that's why he's moving on his own. No, no, you play limbs in town, please. I loved it when they played limbs and then one of them had limb jealousy. <laughs> Gear storage complete. Okay, he ate a arm for sure. Okay, cool. Or he could play limb. Okay. I don't know why he wants to... Playing limbs... He's taking the limbs off the ground, which is maybe because he's a teen and Doggo just doesn't care. I guess we'll keep Ayn closer to Torsolo. He did eat the arm though, so I guess it's not too bad. And he's full hung he's full hunger and yeah, they're good. Okay, beep. You keep doing your thing and raising He's gonna have to raise it by going down here where there's actually our people. Okay, sparring mats complete. Build. I can't see crap. Let 
We have lights outside. Does that take one building material? Let's get that right there. And can't see. You know, we'll start with this one. Did I confirm those? I don't think I did. Ah, light. <laughs> We'll just do torches for now. Confirm those. Okay, now we can look at building. What does it take to build sparring mats? So, oh, they got one for... Uh, that's martial arts. Melee defense is probably going to be the one we want. And of course, we can't see crap, so I'm just going to put it here with a... I'm going to dismantle that light and we'll do two lights right here. Sparring mat takes... Okay, it takes five fabric, two leather. It does not take building materials. So we will hunt for that. Let's go ahead and do some extra research while we're waiting. Um, simple training dummies. Basic weaponsmithing. Wait, do those require books? Okay, it's been paid apparently. Uh, yeah, we'll just do those. Iron's right there. Be cool if Iron could move in here. I really determined to make it happen, but I guess it won't. Maybe because it's in the side of a cliff a little bit. All right, whatever. Uh, beep. Okay, you're... Yeah, we watched that actually go up while I'm just sitting there playing, uh, messing with him. So we're waiting for daylight, which will be in about a minute. He's also getting his athletics up, so. Which is going to be the big one to get him out of here, because we obviously need to run. If he stays light, he should be able to actually r run soon. Pretty fast. And daylight should be just about now. Okay, daylight. 
And with that, I will send out Torsolo. Might have to rename him at one point because he's no longer really Torsolo. Two leather. And we'll take all your fabric. So now we actually filled, because uh, the defense mat is actually pretty good addition. But I don't know how far it will raise. Uh, okay, go ahead and build it. Okay, it's gonna take him a minute to build that. Fine. Go ahead and go over here where the limbs are at. So you can grab it and play limbs, I guess. Doggo, same. Eight severed. Okay, cool. See, that's what's keeping them alive. And I don't have to worry about, like, where to procure food at and for money. Oh, and it's about that time that I go look for more. Problem is, is we gotta actually sever limbs. But Doggo seems to be able to no problem that. Oh, it's a Fog Prince. That's money. Attack. Come on. Yeah, there we go. Come on now. Yep. Follow me. Uh, beep, go ahead and make your way down there. Oh, they give up? Uh, no, no, you, you come back here. dodge out of the way. Come on, you guys are slow. Okay, that one's pretty fast. No severed limbs. They might just eat the... I don't know if they'll eat the bodies or not. Okay, so Fog Prince... Okay, beep. Stop sneaking. Has a head on him that I could take for money. Come on, beep. And I think we can take that to... Oh wait, it doesn't value much. I thought that... Hmm. I thought it used to be worth a lot. Maybe they, they turned that down. Oh yeah, well, let's see what limbs they have. Uh, I forgot to check the uh, limb shops, see if they got anything worthwhile. Okay, that's still being built. Can't click on it. There it is. Okay, yeah, he'll be building that for a minute. Deep, where are you going? Oh, no, that's Torso. Torso is. Nope, stop.
So used to not having to worry about clicking everybody. Oh no, Beep's making it here, okay. Gotta get that athletics up. And 30% of that's from encumbrance. Actually, he's not that slow. It's just, uh, he needs to run just a little bit more. Plus 500% and it's still only like 720. Holy crap. Yeah, I'll sell it, I guess. Oh, maybe there's a certain, I gotta look at who actually buys that. Somebody actually might particularly be wanting that, but oh well. All right, well, we're building that. Beep, go over here. See if there's any limbs for sale. Just so happen to be in here, because that's where we found that really good limb earlier. Ooh, ooh. Uh, okay, a Mark Three Moon Cleaver. Desert Saber. Okay, no limbs, but good weapons. I gotta keep an eye in here every day. I gotta check. I don't particularly care for Moon Cleaver, so I'm gonna keep an eye out for a Ronin Greatsword uh, or a Falling Sun. Falling Suns are decent. Uh, let's check this shop because they also had some. Okay, it's almost done. Get a leather though. We'll keep buying like leather whenever we see it. Because it's like already a hard commodity to get your hands on. That and fabric, and you can only buy it here. Since I can't produce it, we can't grow our own cotton here. Wow, his like options are horrible. I'm surprised we found what we did at the weapon trader. He's still got a decent cleaver, though. He's kept that for sure. I remember seeing that. But I don't want hacker class weapons. All right. One time beeps get back. We should have this. Oh, the mat is... Yeah, it's like, add materials, please. Deep, you can help, too. Okay, that's done. Deep. Yeah, you train there. Yeah, we'll leave him training there for a minute. I mean, I guess while we're just kind of eh, um, I can do like the free research. Because there's not much to be done here. Doggo. 
You know, has he eaten? No. Fine, go ahead and make your way down here. Yeah, I don't know if they eat the bodies or not. Where is Ayn? Okay, there he is. I fast forward full time here. And if not, we'll just have to bring a horde of fogmen back. And if I see a horde nearby, I'll go ahead and fetch them. Uh, we don't, though. Peep, how are you coming along? Wow, he's actually... That's shooting skyrocketing. Oh, yeah. Can't we build... Um... That's for martial arts, though. Trains martial ups, it's 10. Is that what this does? Trains um, up to 10. Okay, so at 10, it's worthless after that. Well, good to get his training up. Okay, it looks like he's not going to eat those. I thought he would. Usually they feast on, well, that might be human bodies. I'm not sure how that works. Yeah, he would have ate by now. So let's head out. Let's go this way this time. Discovered mysterious fog. That's another fog, Prince. I'm not going to go after them. I want I want the the little million group. Yeah, like there. There's a couple hordes right there. Come on. And if I do this, no, this is one. Come on. Yeah, there we go. Keep up. Oh, wait, uh, I'm getting lost here. Okay, wait, we go up this way. Stay back there. Come on, Fogman. Okay. Now attack. Okay. Limbs are falling already. And they've already been eaten. And he's playing with the limb, isn't he? Playing limbs. So you play limbs in here. And that guy's just stuck. 
Beep. Solo, any more to research? No, oh, he's researched everything already. Which is good. So now, yeah, now it's just kind of a wait for beep to train kind of situation. Because once he's able to get out of here, which I want to make sure you can get out of here. I don't want to just have to, I mean, I might have to carry him. That could be a possibility too. Yeah, I don't think I see any groups nearby. Oh wait, what happened, doggo? Oh, more limbs. <laughs> so these guys can all still get up, and Doggo's like right in the middle of them. So they get up, he, ta he noms. Dying, dead, dead, unconscious. So oh, he's going to probably die. Oh, this one. Nom. <laughs> Dude, that dude just got wailed on. Okay. All right. Well, then. Um, yeah, I guess I can take this next one. Oh, it's already been eaten. Never mind. Yeah, see, he's got the limb in his mouth. I really like that. He's like chomping on it. Who's a good boy? Who's a good boy? Okay, beep. You're still training. How's Tor Solo's? Uh, okay, his melee defense is just over 10, so. Toughness 11. Yeah, right now, I guess it's a see what the doggos can do situation. Because they're not really going to get da uh, injured. But we're going to let uh, time uh, go by fast. I forgot to have it fast forward right there. Because we're going to check uh, what's on the market in the next in-game day. There used to be a, it felt like there used to be a lot to do in Mongrel, but it's like it pretty much. Um, once you've kind of done everything here, not really much to do. Oh, a dog bowl. This food storage for animals to get their food from. So technically, if I put it like next to the front door, they could uh, they could eat from that. But I'd like to make dog kibble if possible. Yeah, I'm not going to find Fogman. I would go out there now, but... If it was like a little bit lighter, like not even that's light enough.
Wish you had the upper, uh, option to be like, hey, uh, eat this guy's limbs or something. I'm sure they would. Like, wild dogs do it. Okay, doggo's good. Ein's gonna be hungry next. Luckily, it goes from green, ye uh, yellow, and then red, so it's going to be a minute before they actually are starving, but I still want to keep that up to date while Beep is training. His melee defense is now 10, but I want to see if it goes higher. Because if he can keep that up, then I might actually have Torsolo sit on there for a minute as well. Actually, Torsolo, can you also spar on it? Well, it is going up, so I'm going to leave them just wha wailing away at that. So, once we can get Beep out of here, where to next? Could try to go get spider i mean um mantises but i might wait on that cannibals and stuff up up here we kind of want to stay from this side of the map it's we're nowhere near able to go down there yet might start looking for um the bosses and stuff to take down like a uh, dust king Yeah. And it should be daylight here in a minute. Yeah, melee defense is still going up. It'd be nice to get that to a certain point. If that's the case, I'll actually build the... Uh... Oh, you know, that's a martial arts mat, not a uh, melee attack mat. No, oh, but there's fighting out there. What is it? Yeah, I can't tell what it is. Is it going cause? Oh, you're not cause. Uh, yeah, cause. Like having brain fart on people changing their names. And Dawn should be here. Yep, it's coming. It is coming. Just in time too, because doggos are hungry. Cooper? Oh, you mean Cyber? <laughs> Alright, doggo, head out. Where is a horde of hive? I mean, a uh, fogman. Mm, we'll speed it up a little bit. I don't know what was going on over here earlier. Yeah, hype. I'm head up this way, actually. Where are the hordes? Mine? Uh, yeah, I need to go back here. <laughs> and he's been in prison. Of course, Doggo runs so fast, I actually got to babysit him on the way back because 
he'll outrun a uh, doggo yeah he outrun my camera holy crap he'll outrun um the fogman Well, hell. Go the other direction. I thought there was like an infinite amount of these things. Usually it feels like there are, because it's like they're around when you never want them to be. Mine is getting attacked again. by scavengers oh and fogmen oh perfect uh doggo won't make it back i think in time uh Ein's gonna get hit and beat up pretty bad though doggo He's doing his best. And Doggo's gonna miss it. We were hoping for limbs, but Doggo's like the only one that can sever limbs pretty much. Uh, Ein, please head back to, uh, a training hall and uh we'll we'll heal him up he's got broken arms oh here we go doggo Never mind. Keep Doggo out here for a second. Before I move him off. I'm still making his way. His front leg is eh. Or solo. No, he needs to eat. We may have to get regular food for them. Um, I was really hoping I could supplement with uh, the Fogmen, keeping them busy. Uh, we'll give him those. Okay, he's getting energy back. You sit up here. And Doggo, Doggo, please head out. We need like an army of uh, fogmen. I mean, if I took the time, I could just go to the edge of the Foglands, and I'm sure there'll be a, a gang roaming, but I'm trying to keep it local. Oh, here's one. Come on, doggo. Let's lure them out. Yep, yep, there they go. Yep, yep, there you go. <laughs> uh, I'm going to 
gonna put it on regular speed for the moment so I can manage this a little bit better. Are those scavengers. Oh no, no, they're fogmen as well. Come on, you slow group. All right, we need to head back up this way. I mean, hey, it's what we got to do for doggo food while the rest are training. Speaking of which, are they still... Uh, doggo, go there. Yeah, it's still going up. Come on, you fogman. Fine, how you doing? Let's get you up here too. This one's like, oh, I made a mistake. You going, doggo? Yeah, that's ninja. Intercept Fogman. Discombobulate. Is his arms broken? His arms are broken. Okay, ooh, okay. Move too fast there. I know, get back up here. In fact, Doggo, you have a chance to create another limb. No. All right, well, there's like a couple food items there. And maybe one of them will wake up and we'll do something to him. Oh, yeah, we got to buy stuff. Uh, Torsolo, come on. What were we buying again? It wasn't rations. I already forgot why I was wanting to wait. What was to refresh in stores? It wasn't books. We're going to run out of money eventually. What the hell is that? Oil. Oh, I think I was just checking to see if the legs had replenish. Oh, weapons. That's right. Keep checking for weapons. I think that was it. Eh, we're stocked today. A plank. Um, okay, nothing good here today. I keep hoping. All right, let's check limb salesman. Oh, 
Oh, there's arms up here too. Nice. Uh, I mean, you can hang out up there. Uh, doggo. The other one has... Wait, are both his arms gone? I wish I could double click on them. To center camera. I oh, know he's got... Oh my god, he's super fast. I can't tell. Can't tell if he's holding his stomach or not. Whatever. Okay, we got quite a bit of few, uh, food items up here. Nice. Oh yeah, he did have both arms gone. What am I doing? I clicked on him. Alright, so, for, so check out this limbs merchant. Sad. Actually, his selection I don't think changes. Which is kind of sad. For an actual dedicated store. Oh well. We did get some good limbs at least from this area. blindfold uh why the leather all right we'll go back over here throw that in here for now and i guess continue to do uh melee defense training because that's actually still going up very slowly Probably 15 will be what I will stop at. Who's a good doggo? Oh, he took some hits to the head. Um, here, we'll send Torcello over this way. And how is Ein? Oh, yeah. Oh, no, Ein is doing all right. How are we doing on med kits? Um, still got two. I would like to kind of keep that going. I'm going to hang out up there. What do these merchants have? Cloth. Forgot I could buy them from there, too. Boy, they really want to walk back there. Oh, he's got 100% uh, markup, though. Ugh. All right, let's send him back there. Yeah, we're not going to build too much more. This is all we pretty much need here. It's just some storage boxes and this. So if we ever come back this way, we at least have something to work out of. And it didn't really cost us too much. Hey, come look at my house. I don't know why. Okay, doggos are fed. I think this doggo, will he eat that? I guess when he gets hungry, he will. Yeah, outside of that, we'll speed up time. It's going to be dark again soon. So lots going on. I'll decide what I want to do. We're not ready to take on 
Holy Nation quite yet. I don't know if we're able to take on beak things either, so I don't want to necessarily go down here and get my face punched in. Yeah, we'll hang around the border zone, see if I can find the dust, uh, I think it's the dust king. And uh, take him on. I feel like we might be able to take him on. No, oh, he came down there to eat a limb. Beep, how you doing? You're actually almost a 15. I'll have him stop there and run this way. In fact, I'll have him sneak this way. Also wanna see if I can at least get my hands on a decent heavy weapon. Because Tor Solo's actually getting an okay amount of strength now to where he might be able to handle one poorly, but. Okay, Beep, you made it there. Can you go grab that? That way, I'm going to have him drop these right here. I don't know why dogs weren't touching them. Go ahead and sneak. I'm not going to focus on him being stealthy. It would be cool, but we'll see how things go. And heck, if we find like a, a punching bag of a person, we might uh, put him on just block only and like just get his uh, melee defense up even further. Okay, beep. Yeah, yeah. you're you're gonna go follow Doggo, but uh, but sneak. Oh, he's not gonna do it because Doggo is not sneaking. Never mind. You're gonna just walk this way while in sneak. Okay, Ayn's playing with limbs. Grab the one. And he ate it. So both dogs are back up to kind of full hunger. We still got some legs and arms. Wait for a beep to get to Torsolo and then bring him back down here. All right, Torsolo's got 15 melee defense. There's not much I can do with them. I'll just leave them on it, I guess. R really, honestly, Beep could probably use it more. All right, we'll just keep them on it until um, we need to go. Eh, it should be daylight here in about a minute. Yeah, it's still rising. That's good. Doggo staying fed.
Mm, he's playing limbs again. He doesn't really need to. I probably could have kept him where he was at. Okay, Torcello, go ahead and uh, let's slow down time a little bit. Go ahead and head over to this weapons guy. Well, whenever that opens up. There we go. I will. And you have... Eh. Stock is kind of... Nah. Wait, what did you see? Oh, something yellow. Oh, that one, okay. Dark leather shirt, specialist grade. That's actually not too bad. Hmm. Keep trying the limbs trader. I keep wanting him to have something better, but if he doesn't trade out, if it looks like the same stock, I'm just going to not bother with going this way. So I got to wait for it to open up. Okay, looks like last arm was eaten. Let's actually, how fast is, uh, I don't know if, uh, I can, uh, outrun Hogman. No doggo can. You know, I guess whatever. We'll just send doggo out. Come on, let's go, doggo. Let's go find more foods. Nope, oh, there's some right there. Perfect. They're going at Ein. Looks like he. Ein, don't don't waddle out there on your own. Doggo, come back this way. Get the army on you. Yep, come on. Come on, little fishies. It's like a little school of fish. Oh, here comes more. Yes. All the fog men. Actually, that could be bad. <laughs> I want too many. Oh boy, they whacking on him. Okay, go regular speed. Oh yeah, <laughs> give me all the limbs. Okay, he's... Go ahead and hit. get away, get away. He's hurting. Torsolo, come down here. I ain't actually went down, I didn't see that. Okay, Doggo's still doing his best here. Okay, did you heal him? Yep. 
He'll wake back up no time. Good dog. Good job, doggo. Nope, we got food again. See, that's what I'm talking about. I want more of that. Okay, doggo, you're good. I'm speed up things. You should wake up here. Recovery coma. All right, you pick him up. We'll bring him just inside here and uh, take care of him. Oh, you know what? That might be another way for... Um... Wait, what are they fighting? Oh, there's more frogmen. Oh, the crossbows. This might be a way to actually get the dogs inside the house. You pick them up and... Um... Just run them in. We're actually starting to get really good now with uh, carrying weight and stuff. <laughs> well, the dog's still eating, at least. Got his priorities straight. Beep over there going beep. All right, cool. That's how we can bring him in the house. Nice. Put down. All right, beep. We need you. That's going up so slow. All right, beep. You do more stealth stuff. And Doggo should heal pretty fast. Oh, there you go. He got a limb. The chomp animation is actually pretty good. Well, I guess you can't really tell, but it looked like it. Ayn back up. I'm going to leave Ayn there until... Because he seems to be eating the most. Oh, Ayn's considered an adult now. I guess he's grown. <laughs> His poor face. Alright, Ayn, go ahead and come over here. I want to see... If the size like quadrupled or something. And Ayn's actually doing quite all right. Uh, nowhere near as good as uh, Doggo, but he's doing, he's going good. Man, yeah, we're good for food for a while for the dogs. Keep raising that stealth. And he'll raise athletics too while he's doing that. So I guess that's two birds, one stone. Ein, where are you at? Oh, can I not get out of the house? I guess he can't fit through the door. All right, Torso, pick him up. <laughs> Get him out. And beep. Go back to sneaking. Yeah, I want to see size difference on. Oh, oh he's got to go play limbs. Of course he does. 
I guess I'll have to pause it. They're both uh, boneyard wolves. Let's see, multiplier, six, one, one, oh, four. Okay, there's a big difference there. I guess he will grow, but they get super big. I want to say super big, but probably not much bigger than this. Sheep, what are you doing? Staying close to Doggo? Oh, that's perfect. I just tell him to stay close to Torsolo and then click him down my Doggo. So I keep my camera down there. Maybe. Bodyguard. All right, there we go. Staying close to our solo. Now sneak. Actually, I think he's going to have to do it. Yeah. Deep. Come on, sneak. There we go. How's Doggo doing? He's getting there. Oh, okay, they got like a body cleanup crew, so incinerator right here, and they got a dude going back and forth. This is cool. You can actually do this with your own bases too. Auto task somebody to pick up corpses, so that way you don't like a. At some point in time, you don't have like a million bodies littering your field with like flies just buzzing in your ears. <laughs> So Beep can run 19 miles an hour at his top. That's pretty good. If I can get him to like 20, maybe, I think he'll be all right. Because Doggo, well, Doggo is like fast. What about Ein? See, Ein's only 17. So technically, Beep's good for our party right now, at least for speed-wise. He can keep up. And we're still good on limbs. Where is Ein? Where is Ein? Oh, there he is. Okay. Doggo actually do that. Doggo bodyguard him. I'm just gonna have them run back and forth. That way he can get his athletics up as well. We'll move down south. I think we'll we'll go back out the way we came in. Still doing all right. No research to tech research right now. At least until we get books, but I'm not too terribly. Actually, let me look at what is available. 
basic backpacks. Fabric manufacturer, don't need that. Makeshift walls would be good. Lanterns. Yeah, I guess we'll buy books as we can, but we gotta keep an eye on our money at the moment. Beep as... Oh, that's cool, so I can get his athletics. Okay, I see what's going on now. Encumbrance. Does he have a lot? He doesn't really have a lot. I need to get him a uh, strength. I don't think we have weights. Removing limbs. I can use that to, to upgrade beep if I want to. Yeah, we don't have one. Let's see here, it's still midnight in game. I think we'll do all right. We can kind of handle our own with a semi, I don't want to say a uh, large group of Fogmen, but I think we're kind of getting there on um, at least speed. Okay, Beep can run 20 now total, or well, I thought, it, I, thought I saw he could. This is a good way of uh, training too. Is this? I have them where they're they're bodyguarding uh, Torsolo, but if I click them anywhere else, they'll go to that location and then immediately path back to what their job they're supposed to do. So that's a good way of while you're waiting, instead of having to like move your camera, pan, click, pan, click, and then like micromanage. I think, yeah, this next in-game day, we might try to make our way down south. I think it's time to leave. Oh, wait, weapon. I keep I keep thinking, um... See what weapon guy has. I'm not one. Don't commit crime. Wait for them to open their door. There we go. What do you have? Hmm, okay. That's something. Thing is heavy. Well, 15 kil kilograms, not too bad.
we might get that just to start. Of course, steal it, not um buy it, because I don't have that kind of money. Now, he's got one, two... I'll wait till nighttime. Uh, we can, I can rob these guys easy. And then you and I. Oh, no, no, no. Okay, good. This is over here. I'm Doggo. Okay, you're doing good. Doggo, go ahead and um, we'll grab this uh, leg. Ein, I'll have him grab over here. Okay, he picked up limb. Did you grab Lim? Okay, he's got Lim in his mouth. Good. Good. Keep still doing stealth and athletics. A little bit of a waiting game, guys, but tonight in game, I'll um, in game night, I'll uh, go rob that sword, and then we'll leave the following uh, morning. Gives uh, us a little bit more time to train, also heal up. Oh, is his armor actually giving him a speed bonus? Combat speed effect in this. Oh, okay. Well, what happened there? That dude just ended up face down. Oh, he's got a basket helmet. Hey, Beep, go check that out. They used to just stand guard on either side and look normal. Now that just looks like they're just waiting for something to happen. Well, I guess that is the uh, the truth. Did I take his? I oh, know he's got clothing on. It just looked like didn't look like it for a minute. We might check Shinobi's as well. See if they have um, any decent uh, armor for beep. Oh, he's got human skin. Ugh. Basket helm. <laughs> I still love these. Um, nah, I don't need that. Maybe go talk to Shinobi's. Where is, first off, don't sneak. Okay, first off, cancel your job. I said cancel job. Can't keep up with the game when it's like fast forwarding. Got him, that was plastic surgeon. All right, where is this guy? Or 
Or is he just not available at the moment? Okay, that's a plastic surgeon. None of them. Yeah, not one of them. Yeah, he's gone. Why has he got to be gone? Maybe in town, but I'm not going to go hunt for him. I say that, I'm hunting for him. Um, all right. Doggo, let's get deep. You're going to bodyguard him. But come back here. Same thing with I'm. So, no more limbs. Let's get Doggo. Let's do this one more time. Because Doggo's in full health. See if we can get um, another big group. And then the next in-game day we'll leave. Once I steal that sword. I wonder if we're actually clearing these guys out. I know, I think we can go this way. This used to be the path I used to run, I think, from the, uh, the base location. Might as well go check that place out. Showcase that on stream or something. Yeah, the way up, th this was it right here. Oh, that's right. There's a little way up this way, too. That was a kind of a secret way. So, yeah, this plateau is like a perfect area for building a base. Um, there is one source of water. There is enough for growing. And there's only one entrance over here that you can cut off. And the big one right here that you can cut off. That's not even big. It's a small one. And this one was extra. I didn't know about this one until a lot later. Okay, no fogmen. Nope, there's a couple there, but... Oh, yeah, there's a bunch there. They're off carrying their next meal. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, here they all are. Now, come back here. Doggo, where are you at? See if I can intercept them. Oh yeah, there's like a big group. Doggo's going to take a few hits, but that'll be good. He's got the army after him. All right, come on. Come on, you slow pokes. Can I walk with him? Yeah, 
guess not. Mind your army. Well, this is good for us. More, more training. I kind of remember some of the routes now through the fog, the fog lens. First time navigating it is a nightmare. Okay, it looks like a couple split off. I'm fine with a couple. We still got quite a bit. Or they're just going to think I went the other way. Come on. Yeah, there you go. Or not. You guys are determined to go that way. Here we go. I just had to attack one of them. Oh, they took a shortcut. I think we'll get away with that many. Maybe we'll get like a limb or two out of them. Break time. All right. Let me get back to the entryway here. Oh, it's been two hours already. Pause there. All right, guys, we're going to break for 10 minutes or so. Uh, I'll be back in just a little bit.
All right, guys. I actually have to go, so um, I wanted to stream a little bit longer, but it's all right. Um, I'll be back tomorrow. Um, probably more Kenshi. I want to get out of the Foglands. So, but with that, guys, I appreciate everybody, anybody who showed up or who's lurking or who watches this VOD in the future. I will... I don't, I don't know if it's called a VOD. The recording, or it, it goes up to YouTube. Um, anyways, I want everybody to stay safe and take care. I'll see you in the next stream.